Okay, now before we start guys, and after you clean your uh, muffler, just touch it with your hand. And you guys can hear that sound? Well, that's how it feels when you rub this and it's not clean. Okay, let's go and clean this and you will feel the difference in how it looks. Let's go and do that now. Hello guys, this is Herman again in another Just My Review in another DIY project. Today we are going to use this Maguire All Metal Polish and you guys will see the difference, the retouch we are going to do in our rich lines. You guys will see the difference, the before and after. Stay tuned, let's go and do this now. Let me just show you guys a little bit and put attention to the sound. You guys see the way I got the knife? You know, it's basically sliding, just removing all the rough stuff. You guys basically came here. Wow. You guys can pull uh, pull this down with a pull uh, with a. Uh, you know, with a dish and uh, in, 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 in some chemicals, but you know, I prefer to do it this way because that's just removing basically that and and then with the polish it's gonna be good enough and you feel it like really really nice when you're done with this guys you guys can feel in here the difference you see, wow, this is oof, smooth, really, really smooth. All the stuff, I can feel something right here. Wow, you guys, you guys hear that? And as you guys see, you know, if you guys do it like this, just take a look. Like, let me get it how it is. You see, it's just basically just to remove the stuff, you guys hear that? And as you guys see, if you guys do it this way, you guys not gonna scratch and damage the muffler. Make sure to do it this way. Now, this is just a hint. If you guys wanna do it, you guys can do it. If you guys don't feel comfortable doing it, just don't do it and just uh, use the polish and you guys can... Okay guys, first of all, we have to clean this little guy right here. We're gonna use whatever you want, any rug with water is gonna be enough just to remove uh, the, the dirt in, on top of this guy and around it. And we're gonna see how it looks now. Take a look. Make sure, remember all these areas right here. So far, uh, this truck got around 7,000 miles and you know, it's 2021, but you guys got an idea how it looks right now. And let's go and use this product and see how it is going to look. After we polish this, let's go and get the rack and put a little build disc. Okay, we got this guy right here. And we go, we're going to use an old rack or something like this guy right here. And we're just going to get a little bit of this. Just enough to, uh, you know, to put in this area. And we're going to start going in circles. And you can feel some, I think it's some kind of dirt or stuff like that, like a, uh, some kind of a, probably asphalt or stuff like that that is sticking on this thing. I can feel, I can feel the, uh, 
the surface of this is not quite uh, good and when I use this little guy right here this uh, look at these guys take a look how dirty is this thing well let's go and keep doing this all around just in circles and let's see how it looks when we done this and the idea is keep doing this look at this guys wow this is crazy <laughs> Okay guys, this is something real easy to do. Uh, this is the clean side. Look at, <laughs> this is the dirty side. And, you know, this is just, you know, just the, the beginning basically, because you guys keep, keep polishing this and, and, and you can feel when you touch uh, right around top and on the bottom, you can feel some stuff that, you know, you basically get it on the, on the street and you feel the difference when you take the time and do this. And wow, this is, this is amazing. Okay, guys, I'm done over here and just take a look of this beauty right here. Let's make sure to remove everything right here. And look at the shine in this baby. Look at this guy. Beautiful, right? Let me show you the other one to compare. And look at this. You see all that area right here part of the uh, ex, uh, uh, of the uh, all the contaminants of the engine and you know this is uh, some sometimes it's not easy to remove if you don't use something special but look at this this one it doesn't look that bad but you can see right over here especially right there is a big big dif difference and not only Maguire's you guys can use any kind of uh, Polish, but uh, look at this one. This is so so nice. I just finished my wife's too. Just use a little bit, not not even that much. Look at this guy right here. And I'm talking about this is uh, what uh, 2014. And look at this guy. This is so so nice. This is a Ford Escape. And look at this other one. Comparison this one. <laughs> it's a, a big difference, right? Uh, you know, this is looks like a, well, all the stuff that gets us, us, uh, on top of that, the dirt and everything. And so I, we never cleaned that thing, but look at it. Look at this one, just a little bit of this uh, Maguire's uh, polish, and it's a big, big difference. And when you compare the two right here, uh, it's kind of hard to see it for the distance, but right over there you guys see the difference and when you get closer <laughs> yeah this is dirt and everything's and, and and you know you can clean it but it's still all these dots and everything for the years but when you use the, the polish look at the difference so beautiful right here you guys can see this this guy <laughs> it's a huge difference let me put it side by side this one and this one and you guys can see clearly uh, the difference. Okay guys, well, there you have it. Uh, you guys uh, can use different polish, but this is the one I got so far. I get it in sale in Amazon. I hope you guys can have it too. And uh, check the link down below and probably you're gonna pay the same price I got. I paid $7 for this guy right here. Okay guys, again, Herman in another Just My Review. Please thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and see you guys another day. God bless you all. Bye.